Hey guys, this is Inertia. Today, we're going to be doing a playthrough of a modded survival with the mod Ars Magica. Well, it, it was made by Mythian and it looked pretty cool, so I wanted to do a playthrough of it. I haven't gone, done anything with it. I've eh, looked up the wiki a little bit, but a lot of it is not posted there because the whole point is that you actually go and find spells in towers. So it's a it promotes exploration and it also uh, it stays true to the Minecraft uh, feel without you know over overpowering certain things. It does give you good effects that you can use that could be considered overpowered, but it's balanced so that it requires mana and there's new mobs so well, you'll see. Okay, so I'm making the new world, and it I've got cheats on just for insurance, and it always feels better whenever you. I'll probably I'll probably never use them, but okay. Huh? Oh, I forgot F1 still on. Okay, let's go. Always getting that wood, and I just got I just added the mod, so everything's fresh. So. I have played around with some of the spells and creative and seen some of the things. I just don't remember how to do everything. I know some of the basics, though. Enough to, you know, start off at least. You know, probably look up on the wiki, whatever I need throughout. I love spruce wood. I don't know about you, but it's my favorite out of all of them. And the one I dislike the most is jungle. I just can't stand it. It's like orange and it's yeah tell me what you think in the comments below if you want. this should be my first actual video posted on this channel so go ahead and like it if you like it and uh, comment if you have any criticism or encouragement or anything that could help me because that's always always appreciated let's just get quite a bit of wood I'm rambling see there's my mana I haven't got any right here apparently and this is a newer version the only version I've seen is like an older version I do know though how to do some of the stuff, so alright. Well we're probably going to want to make some tools, so there we go. And just set that down anywhere. Uh sticks. There we go. There's plenty of wood, so nine. That's what we want. Nine, because what I like to do is I like to use charcoal quite a bit. So, what are we playing on? Yeah, I was playing as a normal. Make sure. Oh. I've seen these flowers on creative. I've never used them. I don't even know what they do. Ooh, we can collect them. And they blink. Yeah, there's a whole particle API that's in here. And it's awesome, supposedly. So, all the twinkling effects. There's a lot of cool particles effects with all the spells and stuff. This looks like a perfect place to get some stone. Make a furnace. Actually, cobblestone is used to make runes, as long as they haven't changed it. But who knows? They could have changed something and it could be 
be doing something completely wrong at some point. But I've got the wiki, so anything I need, I'll just, you know, pause, look it up real quick. Won't be too hard. I've already got it pulled up, I think, in my right. Yeah, i got it pulled up right now. Okay. Let's get a little more. So we got to make runes, too, which costs quite a bit of cobblestone. to spawn in a cave and then teleport it out of it. That is cool. Looks like he's attacking me almost. Is he? Yeah, he's attacking me. What the heck? Is that a glitch or is he actually attacking me? He's not looking at me. Alright, that's creepy. That is real creepy looking. I don't know if that's the mod or the new 1.4.6. I have no idea, but that is kind of creepy. And uh, you make runes as long as I haven't changed it, which I'm really hoping to have it, by adding dyes to runes. That's how you make colored runes that have different effects, and then you use each colored rune in certain patterns to, on the inscription table uh, to put to turn a regular scroll into a spell. So. Looks like a dinosaur, and I don't know what that is, but wait, is that? I'm because I'm looking for a tower too. That would be really nice if we saw a tower already. Oh, whoa! What is that? There's something over there too. I think. Maybe not. Huh? There's a bunch of lighting glitches going on with that. I hate that. Um, wait, is that... Maybe not. I don't know. Hello? This must be where the Enderman spawned. Alright. Let's start off by getting some torches. My favorite way, best way to do that. Is by doing the doing this and right here plank. There we go. And see, I got nine because when I cook this up, it'll make coal or one charcoal. I mean, so when it makes one charcoal, we can use that one charcoal to perfectly heat up eight more. There you go. We just got all of that. So now we get eight pieces of charcoal by the end of it. What the heck? Those squids, are they actually water? I mean, uh, blocks just like floating. I swear, these blocks are just floating. Are they, are they squids and I'm just being an idiot? Huh. I'm not seeking. Did they change something and I didn't know it? Why can't I go underwater? Oh. Huh, I knew it! What the heck is this? I guess it must cross into a... I can't... What the heck? What's going on? Must be like another biome. like this episode's coming to a close so see you next episode uh, there you go Get charcoal torches and then next episode we will start diving into the rune making and see if we can make our first spell that'd be awesome all right so i'm gonna go start building a home somewhere find some shelter and then we'll go into there